How many kicks should I fill at 27 weeks pregnant? Usually it is too many when you're trying to go to sleep at night. I was told that a kick count is a good way to monitor fetal health on my own. I haven't felt much of anything lately. Before you freak out over the relative inactivity, remember that the baby sleeps 12 to 14 hours a day right now, meaning if you don't feel anything, it could be taking a nap. Or something is wrong. You can get a more accurate measure by making sure the baby is awake. I don't know if an air horn will have any effect. Drink a cold glass of water to wake the baby up. Or if that doesn't spark movement, put a cold compress on your stomach. That's equivalent to putting cold water on the baby. Yes, and if that doesn't get the baby moving, you don't need to count the kicks, just get to the doctor. Let's assume it isn't that dire. If the baby is awake and moving, you want to count 10 movements within 2 hours. Sometimes the baby moves that much in 10 minutes. If the baby has hiccups, you'll get a slow movement up and down or in whatever angle the child is like a heartbeat until it stops. However, those movements don't count toward the kick count. If hiccups don't count, do you head butts? It is really any movement, whether a baby pushing up against your diaphragm as it tries to get more room to kick into jabbing to trying to shift toward the head down position. I don't think the baby does that for another month. The baby may turn around several times before settling head down, but all the movements like an arm sweep or settling in motion do count toward the kick count. Sometimes it isn't easy to tell what is the baby shifting versus a muscle strain. You should be far enough along not to mistake a baby's movements in amniotic fluid for gas or constipation. I know the difference because gas will pass and constipation won't. You can get a more accurate kick count by laying down on your side. Then any pressure or pulls can't be due to muscle straining. I know I can't lay down on my back anymore. Too much pressure on the blood vessels going to my legs. If you lay down, it may seem like the baby's activity level went up only because you aren't losing track of movements due to your own walking. There's also the fact that walking can lull a baby to sleep. Lay down and start counting kicks when the baby is active and you may get that count of 10 in less than half an hour. And if the baby isn't moving, drink cold water and see if activity perks up or if the count is just slow. And if you don't get 10 movements in 2 hours and you're sure the baby isn't taking a nap, Go to the doctor for a review.